Have you ever found yourself in a situation where you catch a glimpse of a stunning woman looking your way, and you can't help but wonder, is she actually checking me out, or am I just imagining things? Deciphering those subtle signs of interest from a woman can sometimes feel like unraveling a secret code. But fear not. In this video, we're going to unravel it all for you. Here are 12 signs that may give you a clue as to whether or not she's checking you out. Number 1. The Double Take One of the most significant giveaways is when you make eye contact initially, perhaps from across the room. She briefly looks away, almost as if caught off guard or embarrassed, but then her gaze shifts back to you for a lingering second glance. That double take is her subconscious way of stealing one more look because she's attracted, yet perhaps a bit shy to maintain eye contact. Number 2. Preening Behavior This one is all about those subtle, primping habits and self-soothing gestures that women tend to exhibit subconsciously when they're trying to look their best around someone they're interested in. Keep an eye out for things like fixing her hair, straightening her clothes, or checking her makeup. If you notice her making adjustments right after making eye contact with you, she's likely trying to make a good impression. Number 3. She enters your zone. Pay close attention to whether she seems to intentionally position herself near you or in your line of sight when it's not necessary. If she repeatedly finds herself in your vicinity or hovers nearby longer than needed, she could be subconsciously trying to get noticed. Let's delve deeper into the concept of someone intentionally positioning themselves near you or in your line of sight, also known as entering your zone. When someone enters your zone, it means they're making a conscious effort to be close to you or to ensure that you notice them. This behavior often occurs in social settings where there's ample opportunity for interaction. For example, if you're at a party, in a common area like a lobby, or even at a workplace, and you notice that the person you're interested in seems to always be nearby, it's a sign that they might be trying to catch your attention. Number 4. Mirroring This is a fascinating behavior where someone subconsciously mirrors the body language of the person they're attracted to. If you find her posture and movement syncing up with yours, it's a strong indicator that she's trying to establish rapport and closeness. Mirroring is a subconscious behavior where an individual imitates the body language, gestures, or speech patterns of someone they're attracted to or feel a connection with. It's a way for them to establish rapport, create a sense of closeness, and build rapport with the person they're mirroring. Here's how it works, subconscious imitation. When someone is mirroring you, they're essentially copying your nonverbal cues without being fully aware of it. This could include mirroring your posture, gestures, facial expressions, or even tone of voice. Establishing connection. Mirroring is a powerful tool for building rapport because it creates a sense of similarity and mutual understanding between two individuals. When someone mirrors your body language, it signals that they're attuned to your behavior and are subconsciously trying to connect with you on a deeper level. Unconscious Attraction Mirroring often occurs in social situations where there's a mutual attraction or interest. It's a non-verbal way for someone to show that they're drawn to you and are unconsciously trying to build a connection. Example, imagine you're at a networking event and you strike up a conversation with someone you find interesting. As you talk, you notice that they start mirroring your body language. For instance, when you lean in, they lean in too, mirroring your posture and indicating that they're engaged in the conversation. In this example, the mirroring behavior is a subtle yet powerful indication that the person you're speaking with is not only interested in what you're saying, but also feels a connection with you on a deeper level. It's a non-verbal cue that they're attuned to your presence and are subconsciously trying to establish rapport and closeness with you. Overall, mirroring is a fascinating aspect of human behavior that can provide valuable insights into interpersonal dynamics and relationships. It's a natural and often unconscious way for people to connect with one another and build rapport in social interactions. Number 5. Teasing Playful teasing or joking around in a flirtatious way is a classic way for her to let you know she's interested while maintaining plausible deniability. Number 6. Prolonged Eye Contact Meaningful eye contact that lingers for more than a few seconds is a deliberate signal of interest and an attempt to intimately connect with you. 
Number seven, her friends get involved. If her friends start whispering and nudging each other while glancing your way, it's a sign that she's talking about you with her crew. Number eight, she finds reasons to talk to you. If she engineers reasons to strike up conversations with you, she's likely laying the groundwork to get to know you better. Number nine, playing with her hair. Subconsciously drawing attention to her face and hair is a classic flirting gesture. Number 10, positioning herself facing you. If she keeps adjusting her stance to face you directly, it's a sign that she's interested in inviting your attention. Number 11, finding excuses to touch you. Look for innocent excuses to make physical contact which could indicate a desire for closeness. Number 12, giving you her undivided attention. If she puts her phone away, disengages from other conversations, and gives you her complete focus, it's a strong signal of interest. So there you have it. 12 telltale signs that a woman may be secretly checking you out and hoping you'll pick up on her interest. Remember, not to read too much into any single gesture, but if you notice several of these signals together, chances are she's trying to get on your radar. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more dating tips and advice.